Okay, before we get to this video, there's like some nice ass shoddies over there. They have a dog. They're like working out their muscles and stuff. They're like flexing. They're doing yoga. They're playing volleyball. They got long ass socks. They just look nice as fuck, really. Shit. Those are some nice ass shorties. You're playing volleyball and, you know, they're just playing music. Before I get. Oh, okay. Well, I'm fucking up right now. Um. I heard that, okay, people are blowing my ass up about Tom Brady going to the fucking uh, t Tampa Bay Buccaneers. And he's renting a mansion from Derek Jeter, the former uh, New York Yankees player. Uh, number one, people are saying that Tom Brady is moving. See, Tom Brady been at New England for nearly two decades, right, since 2000. And, I mean, fuck, when Tom Brady... Shit. In 2000, Tom Brady joined the NFL. In 2000, Vince Carter won the NBA dunk contest. Well, no, no, Vince Carter won it before Tom Brady was even drafted. Okay, I'm getting thrown off topic again. Um, I mean, fuck. People are saying that Tom Brady's moving from uh New England because of the cold and shit. Bro, Tom Brady been living in New England for nearly two decades, right? You wouldn't think that he would just, you know, want to move because it's cold. He's been living there, and he knows it's cold, right? And, I mean, shit. With all these bandwagon-ass motherfucking uh, fans are just going to Tampa now. Well, actually, I haven't even seen a Tampa fan recently since, like, Tom Brady moved. When Tom Brady moved, I've not seen any Tampa fan that I know of be excited. My homie, uh, Roy Spinks, he's not really happy about Tom Brady because he, I mean, he wants a better quarterback. But, I mean, Tom Brady's a beast-ass motherfucker. He wanted Cam Newton. Um, <laughs> uh, I mean, fuck. My homie, uh, my homie, um, John that lives down in Orlando, Florida, he doesn't really, I mean, shit. I call him bandwagon. I mean, he also calls me a bandwagon, but I don't give a shit. But he gets offended because apparently there's only one team in Orlando that he actually likes, and that's the Magic. The only reason why he likes that is because, number one, he's in Orlando, and number two, because of uh, Shaq and Penny Hardaway. Um, I mean, fuck. Really, I haven't really heard any news from any of my Tampa uh, friends, uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers uh, friends. Uh, fuck. I mean, really... Since Tom Brady is moving cities, I wonder if he, like he's going to have like the best uh, advantage like he did in uh, New England. Because in New England, he had like all these great wide receivers that came and went. Uh, receivers like fucking... I'm not going to include Gronk because he's a tight end. Actually, fuck it. I'll just include Gronk. Uh, Gronk, fucking who else? Uh, he plays for the Detroit Lions now. He was number 80. I think he's number 14 now. I forgot. Uh, Danny Amendola. Julian Edelman. I mean, I think that these are his current wide receivers. Well, not really, because he's in Tampa. Well, he's going to Tampa. Uh, Randy Moss. He played for him in, like, the late 2000s, early 2010s, I believe. Um, who else? Fucking... Uh, no, I think Randy Moss played with him in, like, the 2000s, like, mid. I, I know he played for him. Um, fucking who else? Um, I mean, there's like all these random receivers that come with Tom Brady and just go with Tom Brady. I mean, like Tom, I like I wonder how he's gonna do in like I mean he has um, yeah Tom Brady is gonna stick to his number twelve. I heard that recently. Uh, Chris Goodwin, he's on my Madden team. Um, he's going. He's gonna change his number to like seventeen, I believe, or fourteen. No, I think it's seventeen. Might be 14, but I'm sure it's 17. Um, but yeah, I know Tom Brady is still gonna, he's still gonna uh, keep his uh, familiar number 12, because Chris Goodwin were number 12. So in this off season, he's changing numbers. Chris Good, uh, Chris Goodwin. Um, he might, he was gonna throw to Chris Goodwin, Mike Evans. Uh, number Mike Evans is 13, and um, fuck who. <coughs> Fuck, um, who's those running backs? Um, I'm trying to think of a good ass running back. Well, I mean, fuck. 
Well, I can't really think of a, uh, any of his running backs. I'm sorry if you're a Tampa Bay fan. I'm just really not. I'm trying to think of any. Um, I mean, fuck. I mean, the Raiders probably would never ever gotten him because of our fucking salary cap. We probably don't even have enough money to even, you know, like, give him a contract and shit. I mean, fuck. Unless if you're, like, an NBA player. Usually, if, if you're, like, an NBA player going to, like, a team... I think there's, like, some players that are getting paid, like, ten, tens of millions of dollars. Because, I mean, they fucking suck. But they're, like, getting paid more than fucking, you know, fucking... Like, I don't know. A fucking good-ass NBA player. I mean, like, usually if you play good, they pay good. And, well, I mean, that's what I heard from Deion Sanders... Um, fuck, I mean, shit. I mean, hoes. I mean, come. Um, I said come. Um, I'm trying to think of what's like... I know, I just fucked up. I'm just saying, I'm just making this video because I'm just staring at these girls. I mean, I really had nothing to talk about besides people blowing my ass, so... Shit. Alright, I'm done. Damn, these girls are so fine. Shit. Right, I'm gonna go at them. See you guys. Oh, yeah, if you guys don't wanna, if you guys don't know what they look like, one sec. All right, I wanna. F okay, one sec. Oh shit. All right. Yeah, those are like the shoddies I'm talking about. One of them looks. One of them looks dead, but guys, okay. All right, I'm gonna go, see ya.